European explorers must have been stunned by the vast expanse of forests and volcanoes when they first came to the Indonesian archipelago back in the 15th century. It was an impenetrable world, and another little world full of mysteries. The sands of these mangrove swamps teem with an unbelievable variety of unseen creatures. One of them makes use of his periscope to survey the situation. It's a fiddler crab, named for the outsized dimensions of one of its claws. They get their food from the mud, and it's their playground as well. The crab picks up chunks of mud with its claws and places them in palps in front of its mouth. The mud is filtered through some fine hairs and down the hatch. Of course, the male can only use one of his claws. The other is so big that it's worthless for picking up mud. He uses this claw to mark out territory. And why not? To attract female fiddlers. When he wants to impress them, he'll shake his large claw around vigorously. Several species of fiddler crabs coexist in the mangrove swamp. Nevertheless, these ladies have no trouble telling their own gentleman friends from the others. When a female comes close to his territory, the man of the hour will try to get close to her. Well, actually, she gets away from him and selects a different suitor. She accompanies him to his shelter where nobody will bother them while they mate. It's also common to see two males fighting over a comely damsel at the border between their territories. So many adoring bachelors, and all of them so virile, can only lead to squabbling. <laughs> 